everything. All right. So, what what exactly do you do? Tell us a little bit more about yourself. Where are you from? What do you do? How long you been doing it? Because I can see some footage up here from you doing beard, and they're being spoiled with the steamer in their face. And I like want to drive to you right now. Of course. So, of course, my name is Heaven. I am also known as the Beer Goddess. The and um, what goddess. I do is I work with awesome barbers to provide men with the ultimate male grooming experience. So, especially guys with beards, they typically don't take care of themselves in the way of getting facials and things like that because their beard takes up takes up about a third of their face. Yes. So, um, <laughs> so what I do is I treat their beard um, along with their facial care. So it's, it's a really great experience. It takes um, anywhere from 25 minutes for just a, a um, deluxe beard wash yeah. um, up to an hour for a full facial and beard wash. So it's really relaxing. I mean, everything from, of course, you see the steam, there's hot towels involved. Of course, my uh, my magic hands, as the guys would like to call them, um, are definitely in there. But it's, it's a total experience. Wow. It sounds like it. I'm going to have to come check you out because... Where I'm at, uh, there's nobody who really pampers the beard, you know. I like sometimes before I get a, a nice haircut to, you know, like wash and condition my beard and stuff like that and blow dry it out and then get a haircut. But nobody does that, so I have to do it by myself. It kind of right, so right. it's cool that you offer so, that. So many, yeah, so so many, um, a lot, I hear a lot of guys saying the exact same thing. And, you know, a lot of barbers, they like to cut clean hair. Yeah. So it really makes, it really makes a big difference. And, I mean, your beard is like 60% softer than it was when you came in. It helps with your beard retention, um, you know, throughout the week or, or even uh, longer than that. Um, for guys that come to me more often, um, but you get to learn tips and tricks about your beard specifically. So I do um, specific and tailored um, beard care regimens for guys. Wow. So you can tell me what products you're using currently, and I'll tell you, you know, which ones you should throw away, which ones to keep, um, and then awesome. in what order you should be using them in. Because different yeah. products work for different things, but you know, a lot of people don't. They don't tell you that, and a lot of um, a lot of vendors they're they're actually advertising some of their products wrong wow. just because of some of the ingredients that are in them. If they say, "Oh, this beard oil um, will help with moisture," well, actually, that beard oil may be a um, a sealant, so that beard oil may work better at the end of everything to kind of uh, seal in all that moisture that you've put in after you've washed it and and added your beard butter. And that is why you are the beard goddess. You know your beard stuff. That is, I oh, do, so I do. That's so cool because not too many people know that. As you can see, I'm into my beard and I want some of your stuff. You see that beard? Yeah, I'll tell you, yeah, I do. <laughs> the only, I'm telling you, the only reason it's not bigger is because my two-year-old son, or he just turned three, but he keeps cutting it off. Uh-oh. Yeah, so we need to get him to start letting me let me grow the beard instead. Yep. You are too Okay, well, that. luckily luckily your beard grows faster in the summer, so hopefully, uh, you know, it'll catch up. Is there anything I can do to help it grow? Anything that you suggest? For, you know, um, the for number my people one thing is listening? like the, like the gentleman who was just saying, you know, as far as food and nutrition and staying hydrated, that's probably the number one thing to keep your beard healthy. Wow. Um, you know, that the hair needs that nutrition yes. to grow yes. and it needs yes. that water to help feed the follicles, <clears throat> you know, all those good salads and things that we should be eating. Um, I'm actually, I'll start my 30 days of no meat uh, tomorrow. So I definitely oh. understand that. Yeah, so definitely drink your water, stay hydrated, especially in this heat. Um, and my number one tip, always stay hydrated. So hydration. That, yes, the, the body needs water. That's, that's Yeah, and the beard. Yeah, uh, yeah, sure clearly body. the, the beard exactly. needs some hydration. Body and the beard. Body, the body and the beard. Right. Yeah, we're talking about the right. beard here. Forget the body. Dry hair doesn't grow. <laughs> Forget the body. We're talking about the beard Well, here. if the body isn't healthy, the beard won't <laughs> grow. Dry hair does <laughs> not grow. Dry yeah. hair does not grow. It'll just healthy. be brittle and it'll break off. Yes, so exactly. Just make sure you do that. Man. So, you are too cool. So how is she still on? Yes. Oh, so so how 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 can um hi hello um sister salute to you. Um, sister salute to you. Uh, you look like you got an awesome product here. Uh, so how how can I get some of your products down at the barber bar because uh, we have these uh, men's grooming supplies. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that we carry out there. Excuse me one second, Heaven. Just so you know, the two gentlemen yeah. who are pretty much involved in this in this in this interview, they both sell products. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. We're both, they're vendors. both vendors. They're both vendors. So. If you got some products, these are the people that you want to talk to. Well, I don't ever just push one product. I mean, I push uh, a multitude of things. 
So I like to go out and I, and I hunt and find for great products for guys to use, and then I do reviews on them, and I tell them what they should and shouldn't be buying. Oh, okay. Um, so that's pretty much how it works. But um, those are two of my favorite products right oh. now. I might have used some other ones, but I do like to support uh, small businesses. So those are two small businesses that you can definitely reach out to and um, and get their products. They're they're absolutely awesome. I wouldn't push them if um, if I didn't didn't think think so and use them myself uh, on a regular basis. Probably about eighty percent of my clients I use those two products on right now. Um, cool. But if you're looking for me specifically and you want me to come and or if you want me to come to an event and you want me to vet and help you um, push a certain beard product or facial care product, um, you can definitely reach me on oh. Facebook and Instagram beard underscore goddess. So while you're at those vendor events, you know, at those events, your Bonner Brothers or some of the other shows, people like to see your product being used. Yes. So, you know, having having me there, definitely putting on the show and and showcasing um, the the goodness of your product, I'm always willing to do so. Oh, beautiful. So, beard underscore goddess on Facebook and on Instagram. You can also call me, text me, 